What is going on, my people? It has been a, whew, it's only been a week, but it feels longer, especially with a lot of stuff that's been going on between, you know, the baby. Uh, obviously, I know Toys R Us is going down, which they're probably like, eh, why does that mean anything to you? But if anybody knows, I work for Toys R Us, so that kind of sucks. But uh, yeah. It's been a while and you know between work um it's just been you know not enough time to do much uh collecting but today i got my first sh figure arts <laughs> One of my uh, friends, buddy of mine, that uh, used to work for me during seasonal for Toys R Us, he was uh, getting rid of one of his figure arts, and for the price, I couldn't say no, and so this is what it is. Madara Ushia! <laughs> This thing is a beauty. I am no longer a SH Figure Arts virgin. And this is one of the four that I've wanted. And for the price, I was not going to say no. But yeah, uh, the homie hooked me up. Met up with him after work. And uh, he also hooked me up with a diorama. So I'll show that in a bit. But yeah, so. It was also his birthday, which was actually yesterday. So once again, happy birthday, Maji. You already know. So let's open this up. So this is how it comes packaged. It's a nice tight seal. This comes with uh, different face scopes, uh, different hands, got the jutsu hands, comes with extra arms. As you can see, that face is beautiful. And then in the back, it comes with his uh, weapons and the chain that combines it. So I'm gonna take this out the box. And so, there you go. It's got that long hair. It's got that, that crazy look in his eyes. It's got the crossed arms. It's got the articulation, the articulation we yearn for. He even got articulation in his toes. Um, you could take this piece off to take off his face and swap it, I believe. Um, you can take this off to take the crossed arms off and switch it to, uh, you know, these these arms that have uh, really good articulation, as you can see. Look at that. Some really good articulation and then obviously you could change the hands you know to like you know jutsu hands which is freaking probably what I'm gonna have them posed in uh, I believe that these hands can uh, go into one another like this like in the show like if he's doing a jutsu I believe him and Itachi is the only figures at the moment, uh, figure arts that can do that. I'm not 100% sure, so don't uh, don't judge me if I'm wrong. It's got like these little power hands, but the detail and everything on this thing is beautiful. This was one of the figs that I've wanted if I had to get an SH figure arts. Uh, I want to get Super Saiyan 3 Goku. I want to get the Flash that's coming out from the Justice League. And I need Itachi because he's my favorite character from uh, Naruto. But look at that. That articulation, man. Woo! Got some. There you go. Oh, his leg came off. Whoops. Don't mind me. I'm recording as I'm looking through the screen. So it feels a little weird instead of just looking at my hands. 
But yeah, I'm gonna pose this guy, take some pictures and show it at the end of the video. Once again, shout out to uh, Curtis for hooking me up with this. And I'm gonna jump into the diorama now. I actually forgot to show off the weapons, but this is uh, one of his weapons. You got the, I think they call it, this is called the Scythe, Scythe, I don't believe. You got the, the fan he uses. The, you already know. And then it comes with this, which is, I'm so hyped that this is actually like a, like a metal material. If anybody watches the show, then you would know that these little pieces connect to one end on one piece and one to the other. And then he, you know, kicks ass with it. So, yeah. And so this is also my first diorama. Uh, it's basically like like stone stone walls. Mm -hmm. Has a little opening, and then it's got like this little uh, broken top wall, with, like little cracks and stuff in it. I did not make this. Uh, the birthday boy, Curtis, the homie. My broski, the one who uh, sold me the fig, uh, made this for me. It's pretty good, pretty good. I'm trying to make a little sword cap with a Gears of War logo. <laughs> well, all around it's not too bad. Uh, I got bored of um, having my figures like this. Just plain, plain old uh, shelves. So I'm gonna plot this in there and yeah. I might took it out a bit a little bit. I might add some shading in the cracks a little bit to make it more visible and stuff, but I don't know. Uh good looking brother on hooking me up with this. I appreciate it. So yep. Yeah. First H figure arts, first diorama. This damn figure is amazing. Um so once again. Shout out to you, Curtis, for hooking me up with the fig for a good price and the diorama. Uh, and then we also got a mail call from P-Town. Uh, he hit me up a while back and said that he wanted to hook wifey up. And so he got her this. The giant from Game of Thrones, the exclusive. Uh, it got, it's a little damaged, uh. I guess through shipping and got bended right here. I don't know if you can see that. And it got a little a little damage there. But all in all, wifey's happy that she got one. Uh she's not here because she's actually staying at her mom's until she gets birth because uh she's already hit that 37 week mark and she's you know the baby can come any day. So she decided to stay at her mom's until she basically pops because the hospital that she wants to go to is like super duper close. So, uh, I'll jump to a clip. What's up guys? It's She Hood from iPop here. I don't know if I'll be told you that of why we haven't been recording, but most of you should already know because, you know, the baby. But, um, yeah, just a little quick thank you to P-Town and the Huntress for sending me the giant white from the eccc that's actually my first one of this year i didn't want to collect none of those and i was shocked that i even have it so thank you but yeah we haven't been recording and i haven't even seen the pop in person because i'm staying towards my grandmother's way so I'm closer to the hospital and preparing for labor, which doctor says any minute, any hour, or any day, anything could happen. I'm already like one centimeter open, guys. <laughs> Pray for me. But yeah, thank you to everybody, and I hope you enjoy the video, because I'm pretty sure hubby's recording something, or recorded, I don't know. But yeah, hope you enjoy, and make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Oh, and don't forget... Pass along to one of your friends. That's important. Silas says so. Alright. Deuces. Peace.